A celebration of Nordic music as Finnish conductor Hanu Lintu conducts the CSO in works by Sibelius and Nielsen. Jean Sibelius embarked on his fifth symphony at Ainola, his lakeside cottage in the forests outside Helsinki. The brooding and ecstatic score is often regarded as his finest symphony, but it was revised extensively in the years after its 1915 premiere. During this time, Russia invaded Finland, and Sibelius and his family took refuge in a psychiatric hospital where his brother was a physician. But the fifth suggests a heroic tenacity and a deep love of nature. According to the composer's diary, the final majestic horn theme came to him after he witnessed 16 swans flying over his home. Carl Nielsen wrote the Helios Overture while spending the winter of 1903 in Athens, where his artist wife, Anne Marie, was studying Greek art. The mild weather was just what the Danish composer needed. He found inspiration in Helios, the Greek sun god who drove his chariot across the sky each day. The 12-minute piece evokes the rising and setting sun over the Aegean Sea. Nielsen began his violin concerto in the summer of 1911 near Bergen, Norway. He was visiting Nina Grieg, widow of Edvard Grieg, and worked in his composing hut on the shore of Lake Nordas. Nielsen predicted that his concerto would be rich in content, popular and dazzling, without being superficial. Unusually, it's set in two movements, each full of relaxed, affable melodies. Its 1912 premiere by violinist Peter Müller was a resounding success. Our soloist is Pekka Kuzisto. The program opens with Finlandia. Sibelius wrote this rousing tone poem in 1899 for a public demonstration against press censorship. It was originally called Finland Awakes, then revised as Finlandia before the Helsinki Philharmonic took it on a European tour the next year. With its hymn-like victory theme, the piece carried Sibelius's name throughout the world. After Finland gained independence from Russia in 1917, Finlandia was heard as a musical symbol of the nation.